Hello everyone, welcome to a brand new episode of Deer Hunter where I give you advice from a guy's perspective. Soph asks, what do I do if I like a guy that my best friend also likes? I don't want to ruin our friendship, but he's really nice to me and I think he likes me back. Oh my god, this one's a toughie. If you'd hate to be in a position like this, let me know by liking this video. Now, on one hand, no one guy is worth more than any best friendship. On the other hand, though, true love is the most powerful emotion ever. There's two ways to go about this, so let's just focus on one. Here are the tips to get the guy and keep your friend. Number one, find out who he likes. Your friend may really like him, but if you know that he's only interested in you, then tell your friend to back off. Well, don't say it like that. Instead, do step number two. Ask your friend politely for permission. Make sure to get this hard but important step out of the way as soon as possible. Now, they may or may not grant you their friend blessing, and if they don't, you have to decide for yourself what's more important, the bestie or the boy. And if they say it's okay, then follow these next steps. Number three, be open and honest with your friend. Just because you ended up with a guy and your friend didn't, doesn't mean you should hide your relationship from anyone. Going behind your friend's back to hide the relationship is only going to ruin the trust in your friendship. Number four, make everyone friends. Let's say, fingers crossed, that you and this guy become serious and you really like each other. Then that guy and your best friend should be friends too. This will make everything easier in the long run. Trust me. Okay, now those tips are for those of you who decide to go for the boy. That's not always the best option. Some guys seem perfect to you, your best friend, and heck, they seem perfect to everyone. And it's nice to think that he'll be your boyfriend and your best friend will be fine with it. If that happens, great, but oftentimes those budding romances don't work out. So you end up with a failed relationship and you might end up jeopardizing your beautiful years-long friendship for a guy who it may or may not work out with. In the end, Soph, it's up to you to make that decision for yourself, but I wanna know from everyone else watching, would you pick your best friend or the guy of your dreams? If you only could pick one, let me know who it would be in the comments below. And remember to subscribe to Awesomeness TV for more Deer Hunter every week. And follow me on Twitter, Matt Hunter March. I'll see you guys later. Do you like to ship up your favorite celebrities? Well, so do we. Check out the ship up to see who we're pairing up this week. You won't believe what happens when we do. Can you please do a video on how to know if a guy is playing you? Honestly, some guys are just cold-blooded players, and if you know that's true, let me know in the conversation. You feel like everything you say will be awkward and that you'll somehow mess it up, so before you go up to them, go up with a genuine, short, and sweet thing to say.